It's a beautiful morning in Napa. I am starving. I have my comfortable shoes on. View from my room, take a look. It is out sunbathing. The vineyards are across the way. And I'll probably have to hit the pool and check that out a little bit later. Instructions on how to play bocce ball. This guy's over here putting napkins in his thing. <laughs> Just little baby tacos. It better taste good. That's one taco. For you. So I just got a massage. It was amazing. And I feel great. This is the aftermath. Came back to the room and it looks like they uh, folded down the bed and put a piece of chocolate. Isn't that nice? Just came from the spa and feel relaxed, great. The Napa River Inn Spa, definitely a place to go to if you want to relax, chill, get a good massage, a facial. The products they have um, are actually really amazing. My skin feels so soft and looks so nice. I almost don't want to even take a shower, but I am, just because it's really, really nice. Should have bought some products, but definitely will do that in the future. But I'll show you around the room a little bit. Nice little chairs, a balcony out there. That's me, a TV. The bathroom is over that way. This is really cool, I like how they did this. Night view from the balcony. There's a lot of seating areas at this place. It's really cold out now. The weather is so drastic out here. We're gonna head down to not downtown Napa to go on a food tour, which I am definitely ready for. I can't wait to see what I'm gonna be eating and what I'm gonna be learning about the area. I'm on a food tour. I think there's other people going to join us here. Apparently over there is the best coffee in town. You have to come here for that. Two virtual coffee. <laughs> Not quite sure. The entrance to the Napa Wine Train. 
So you don't necessarily have to drink wine to go on the Napa wine train. But you can eat too. Now we're going to get tacos. The last paranza. Third generation taco truck. Uh, house made slob and then some queso fresco on there. How do I so please enjoy. Ajoli sauce and roots. That's really good. That's what I'm talking about right here. These are taken for the Twin Towers. Candy shop. Oh, it's so cute. And that's chocolate. It's nice and cool in here. I'm just need to break from the uh, we're in Clemente's, which is a local favorite, and apparently it's in a liquor store. How funny is that? It's a very savory roast. The best spinach, onion, garlic, parsley, oregano, rosemary, cheese, eggs, bread, and uh, eggs. All, all mixed together. And uh, one by one is rolled by hand. Wow. Now, if you're a vegetarian, we have vegetarian sauce. But in a, not, 99 and a half percent of the customer. They mix it with ravioli and malpati with meat sauce. So I just said that in case somebody, they vegetarian, they can have their marinara. Okay, getting a cupcake from here. Awesome. We're back at the Oscar World Market. Get another cupcake. All the good food and heat, I'm ready for it now. around a vineyard really um, the Meritage Resort and Spa where I'm staying has their own vineyard that I could see right across my room so I was like hey let me walk up didn't realize I was be walking up stairs and hills and whatnot I seem to be the only person out here by my little loans himself I get snatched up come find me anyway so you can see all of this that looks like it needs some water. It's really hot out here. It's really pretty, but really hot. But not as hot as earlier. Earlier was absolutely disgusting. So I don't think I'm gonna walk too, too far. Cause I'm not sure where this leads, and I still have to walk all the way back. But I'm gonna see if I see anything really pretty or really good views from up this high. Looks like you can have your wedding up here. It's a really pretty setting. Get married right there, have your people watching you there, and this is your epic background. So pretty. Stand here and just give your mouth. 